It's pouring out here, literally pouring. And I thought Jess was waiting in the car. There's no one in the car. And she has the car keys. What are we going to do? I am absolutely soaked. Man, you're fishing with the family. Family fishing. Man, you're fishing with the family. I don't know where I'm with the family. Good old grappling hook. Yo, that's some serious fishing line somebody was using in here. Why? Yeah, I'm pulling something up. Oh, there's a... Yeah, tell me there's not like a dead fish. Oh, okay. A, a cage. cage. Probably tried to trap a fish. No, that's from like a... Something. It looks like a dishwasher, Ryan. Yeah. I want to see this lure, though. Some big boy sinkers. No lure. We got this out of the water, so that's good. Hey, wait. What's that? I'm going to get it with my bag. What are you going to get? That. What is that? I don't think it's magnetic. No. I think it's a broom. Uh, yeah. Oh, I got a... I did get a piece of metal. I got a baggie, bag. So whatever's floating towards us, we'll get that out of there. Yeah. Got a broom handle. Or something. It was a stick, Riley. I could yeah. see from here. That was a stick. I don't know what the hell that is. So there is a lawnmower down there. This is the, uh, this is the piece that shoots the grass out of a lawnmower. And last time we were here, we found like the, the handles and the throttle part of a lawnmower. What is that? Oh my god, it's a part of a lawnmower. It's a, it's a lawnmower handle. So, so there's a lawnmower down in there somewhere. And I'm getting... Oh, dude, bring it over! On your magnet? Yeah. We found a bullet. Nice. Good job, buddy. I got a... I got a microwave? A microwave. Or, or a toaster oven. I got a toaster oven. I'm pretty sure I got a reel here. The end of that string. Just, just feel it around in there. I could feel it coming off the reel. I have a reel. And I saw it plop up. I just don't know if it's going to be magnetic. There it is right there. It's not magnetic though. Yeah, I know, but I can't get it. I want to get it. Got it. Yeah. A nice, nice spool of fishing, fishing line. What do we got here? Huh? I got the lawnmower, or the the body of the lawnmower. Let me show you guys these snails. So here's one right here. He's a big guy. He just let go there. That's a pond snail. They have this little foot. Closes up. It opens up backwards. And then all their snailness comes out. They actually seal themselves up with that. And they can live without water for days. Might as well just do grappling hook fishing videos. because I love using this thing. If you guys are interested in getting into magnet fishing, in the description below, there's a link for Wukong magnets. And if you use my code, 
Shane 16, you get 16% 16 off your entire order. So make sure you check that out. It's going to be in the description below. It's a cut up piece of a tire. Obviously a lot of the stuff we're getting out of here today is big stuff. So we're going to do our best to clean this up at some point. We do not have a pickup truck right now, so we got to wait till we get a pickup truck. All right, it feels like we got something. And we do. We got a tire. And whatever that is. I think that's from the one more, the back piece. Nice. Doing really good today cleaning up this pond. The whole center of this thing is just like large items. It's crazy. There's something big out there. Ah, oh, dude. This just fell off a, a chunk of stuff that I had. That's a big crayfish. He's a big boy. Look at him. See how he only has one big claw and one little claw? That's because if their claws fall off, they can grow them back. Is he not pink yet? No. No, they're usually pretty nice. I'm going to try and catch a video of him swimming away when he leaves. Say hi, buddy. Hello. I'm hoping my camel get him swimming away because they're cool when they swim. Here he goes. Gone. That's cool. Yep, they just dart backwards. Uh, if it gets, if it rains any harder than this, yes. That crayfish, that's one of the things that we're trying to get this place cleaner for. We're getting a lot of this metal out of here, toaster oven. Hopefully we find, if, they, if the engine from the lawnmower is in there, hopefully we can get that out of there. It's not all about what you find. I mean, finding stuff's cool, but one big part of it is just making sure that it just the world around us is cleaner. So once I get a truck, I'm going to come over here and we're going to get all this stuff and we're going to take it out of here. And that's going to be awesome. If you do something good, while at the same time looking for cool stuff, that's just a win-win. We got a net. Yeah, buddy. Maybe start getting packed up. You can just throw all that on the bucket. Don't worry about it. All right, we gotta get going, buddy. All right, so it's pouring out here, literally pouring. And I thought Jess was waiting in the car. I thought Jess was waiting in the car. She was not waiting in the car. There's no one in the car. And she has the car keys. Her and Jack went for a walk in the woods. They are definitely soaked somewhere. Riley, what are we going to do? <laughs> I am absolutely soaked head to toe. We are soaked right now. I don't even know what to do. Jess! Oh my god, this is ridiculous. My phone is... Look at my phone, Riley. <laughs> my phone is just soaked. So my phone, my vape, my GoPro's in my pocket without a case. My phone doesn't have a case on it. And everything is just soaking wet. We're right here! Are they in the car? Dude. What the fuck? I am wet. Where were you? Why didn't you come back when it started raining? We were making our way back. Now we're yeah. in the car. You have the keys. No, I don't. I don't have the keys. Did I have the keys the whole time? Oh my god. I had the keys. I put them on the ground. And because it started raining, I just I left. 
as I just had them. It's gonna be such a funny video. So, if you like this video, make sure you hit the thumbs up button, subscribe, tell all your friends, every friend you have, tell them about it. So, have it if you sent us down. So we